Hello everyone, in today's video I'm going to show you how to revert the Discord UI back to the original and this is the updated version as of today, April 15th, 2025, as they have recently, a few days ago, removed the experiment from Vencord to refresh your desktop app into the old version. But don't worry, I will show you how you can get your old UI right back. Before I begin this video, if you have any problems with your Discord account or your Discord server, or any questions you'd like to ask, please join my Discord server. It is in the link in the description below. We have a support channel there where you can ask all sorts of Discord questions that you have, and I will try to answer all of them with my extensive knowledge. And please check out my other tutorials on how to create amazing Discord servers in my playlist on my channel. And if you have anything else you need help with Discord related, please check my YouTube channel. I make Discord content and lots and lots of well-made Discord tutorials to show you how to do anything you need, including creating an amazing Discord server. So anyways, let's continue back to the tutorial. So that's right, guys. Vencord had recently had an update where they removed the experiment uh, plugin with the desktop refresh plugin, uh, which everyone was using to actually revert their Discord UI back to the original. And I bet you're clicking on this video because you want to figure out how to fix that again. So what we have to do is first install Vencord. If you don't have Vencord installed, or if you don't know what I'm talking about, please click on the link in the description below. I have a link to a tutorial on how to set up Vencord for your Discord account. And once you have it installed, the exe file here, you'll simply click install to patch the Discord app on your PC. Uh, by the way, this is for PC, of course. Uh, you can't, I, I don't know of any way to revert the mobile UI, uh, but this is for PC, and this is probably why you're clicking on this video. So all we're going to do is click install to patch our Discord client. And then if you open up Discord once again and go back to your user settings here, we can see that Vencord is in, and you can see all the different things that Vencord has in the user settings. Um, so the thing is here, if you actually go to experiments and look up um, visual refresh, or okay, wait, I guess, well, it's not there anymore. But it, it was called desktop visual refresh, and that is what people were using to revert it. They would simply click on it, and then click not eligible or any of these options here, and it would fix it just, just like that. Uh, but they fixed it. They did a new one called desktop refresh fast, fast follows, uh, but this one doesn't actually do anything when you change it. So, of course, you're on this video because you want to revert it back to what it was. Um, so that doesn't work anymore. So what we have to do now is actually go to Google and search up old cord okay and you will see on the top link here a github link and the link will be also in the description below uh, but if we go to this link here it's, it's github.com slash milbits slash old cord okay now don't worry you don't have to install anything weird any weird code or anything you don't have to run any scripts anything weird like that i would never do that all you have to do is just scroll down to the bottom here and by the way if you're using better discord you could do this with better discord as well uh, but we're doing this vencord because it's a lot easier and you don't have to um, download anything weird so of course you can download the css file but i wouldn't recommend it because once again it's a github link and I don't want to get you to download something for no reason if it's not totally trustworthy. So, so to make it easier, all you have to do is just copy this link here on the bottom. It'll be milbits.github.io slash oldcord slash src or source slash main.css. So you're just going to copy this uh, little bit of text here. And that's it. You don't have to do any downloading whatsoever except for the Vencord itself, obviously. But most of you guys probably already use Vencord as you probably had to use it for the previous revert when you had to do it before. Uh, so once you copy and paste, or not copy and paste, just copy that, uh, you'll go back to Discord here. Uh, you'll go back into your user settings. You'll go under the event cord tab once again. Uh, and then you'll go into the themes tab, okay? And all you're going to do from here is go themes. You're going to go to online themes, and you're going to paste the link to the CSS files. So essentially, you are directing um, Vencord itself uh, to go to this Go to the link basically and take the files from it for you so you don't have to actually install it onto your computer and then upload it yourself so you, all you have to do is literally just control v paste it in there click off of it and it will revert it back to the old ui now the ui is not perfect it's not perfect but if you notice on their github they actually just did a push to it a couple hours ago so they're actually updating it and if you actually click on this here uh, we could see what they actually did and we could see that they fixed. So it says fixes for bottom left user card and button. So they are actually applying fixes to this 
currently as we speak because there is a lot of people actually downloading this and using it right now uh, because it's actually working so they're trying to make it so it actually looks as good as it possibly can uh, because everyone wants it to you know to look like it was before uh, so we can see there we have done it and it is done so if we exit here it is all back to normal now it's a little bit wonky but for the most part it looks like the old ui there's nothing new the colors all original and most importantly the servers are now circle again nice and large and the folders are circle inside so the the servers inside the the folders are circle um so it's basically everything that you could ever ask for and you could drag everything out it looks a lot better not perfect but a lot better than the other ui because if we go back to the other ui here let's if we enabled or disable the theme here just remove it uh we can see that this is the other ui with their square servers and all that sort of sort of stuff that we've been trying to get used to for these last uh, couple of weeks so so either way though that is kind of how you revert this theme is by pasting this link in here in the online themes under themes under event cord in the event cord section on the settings once again the link to the github will be in the description below so make sure to click on that or just search it up do whatever you want really but this is how you do it uh, once again please subscribe to my channel i am going for 2,000 subscribers and once i hit it I will be giving away three months of Discord Nitro. And now, to join that giveaway when that starts, you have to be in my Discord server. So make sure you join my Discord server. We're on track to 1,000 members, and I'd love to see you here. And once again, if you have any issues with Discord setup or your Discord server, please ask the questions here or check out my tutorials on my channel. Please like this video, share with your friends if you want them to get the old UI back as well. And I'll see you guys in the next Discord tutorial. Bye-bye.